The Brazilian Cooperation Agency, ABC, under the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Brazil and the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, FAO, celebrate the 10 years of the Moore Cadden Project, a trilateral South-South cooperation initiative in partnership with seven partner countries, Argentina, Bolivia, Colombia, Haiti, Ecuador, Paraguay, and Peru. As part of the Brazil FAO International Cooperation Program, the Moore Cadden Project is an initiative in partnership with more than 100 institutions from the public and private sectors to strengthen the cotton sector in the region. Thanks to funds from the Brazilian Cotton Institute, IBA, and ABC, Brazil's successful experience has been a reference for the project through the sharing of good practices and technologies that can contribute to the rural development of family-based cotton farming and boost the agro-textile system. Over a decade, the project's partner countries have invested in public policies and programs to leverage and promote sustainable cotton production. Bolivia launched its National Cotton Production Support Program. Peru reformulated its national plan. Colombia included cotton among the 10 priority crops. Ecuador strengthened research. And Paraguay reactivated its cotton board and cotton production in the Chaco. In order to generate more knowledge for extension and research professionals, the Moore Cotton Project has promoted training, national and international missions, studies and innovations from production to consumption. In Argentina and IT, important studies were done based on the cotton chain situation analysis, which will serve as the basis for implementing country projects. More than 150 field days held and 128 demo plots set up provided the means for good practices to be shared on topics such as soil and pest management, association of cotton with food crops, mechanized harvesting and access to markets. In addition to promoting an increase in production, the project has also boosted the competitiveness of the cotton sector to better position the Latin American cotton and connect family farming to sustainable markets, thus increasing the income. With the support of the Brazilian Association of Cotton Farmers, ABRAPA, actions have been implemented to promote access to markets with technical assistance for formulating business plans and participation in events and business roundtables. Together with the Cotton Unit of the Brazilian Agricultural Research Corporation, Embrapa, and national institutions, efforts have been put into improving the supply of certified seeds in partner countries. Bolivia, Ecuador, and Paraguay have reactivated their national seed production, which has contributed to increasing the yields and production of higher quality cotton fibers. Seven Embrapa's cotton varieties were validated. More than 86 accessions of native cottons were collected. Seven national varieties were validated and more than 41 tons of seeds were produced. In line with technology development, the Moore Cotton Project has been embracing innovation as a driver for the sustainable development of family-based cotton farming. The One Row Harvester, developed by Embrapa Cotton, is a milestone in the investment in technology at the service of family farming, as well as other equipment adapted to the small farming areas. Another innovation is the use of drones. In Ecuador, the equipment was used to analyze crops and yields, whereas in Colombia it is used for applying pesticides and fertilizers. In Peru, the use of the digital agricultural tool Smart Agro 4.0 in pilot farms has contributed to making water management more efficient in cotton farming. To promote digital inclusion in rural areas, the project designed the Lasso's app, a platform to connect the main players in the Latin American cotton sector. The Moore Cotton Project has strengthened technical assistance and rural extension, allowing more than 14,000 farmers and family farmers to have access to information and training on best farming practices for cotton and food crops. Together with the Company of Research, Rural Extension and Land Tenure Regularization of the State of Paraiba, Empire PB, methodologies were adapted to control cotton ball weevils with biopreparations, thus promoting the rational use of pesticides. Economic sustainability goes hand-in-hand hand with food security for cotton-growing families. To this end, the cooperation initiative with the support of partner institutions has been promoting the diversification of the production system in partner countries, whereby cotton is associated with food crops such as corn and beans, a system inspired by the model in place in the northeast of Brazil is to give visibility to the important role that rural women play throughout the cotton value chain. 
from farming to selling clothes. In order to create more spaces at the regional level for women to have a voice, the Latin American Network of Cotton Farming Women was launched to improve the exchange of knowledge and dialogue among cotton farming women. With a focus on the cotton farming youth, the project has carried out actions with students from agricultural technical schools and young family farmers to boost their confidence about relying on the countryside and cotton farming as a source of income and employment. The project has also supported the reaffirmation of the cultural, religious, historical and economic importance of native cotton so as to preserve its valuable ancestral heritage hand-in-hand -hand with native peoples of several partner countries. Over 10 years through this cooperation initiative, cotton has once again been featured in the media of partner countries as a result of the project's communication strategy. A space for dialogue about cotton was created among partner countries with support from the project. The Regional Cotton Forum provides the means for carrying out exchange of experiences and discussions about challenges and opportunities related to the cotton value chain. The collaboration between FAO, ABC and partner countries is a showcase for the mutual benefits of working together and promoting international cooperation. Thanks to the dedication of women, men and young people who sew, harvest, gin, spin, weave, manufacture and market, the cotton value chain has been strengthened with the support from those who do research and provide technical assistance and rural extension, all of which are part of this history of cotton in Latin America that has begun to be rewritten since a decade ago. A history that moves everybody forward together, because together we are more cotton.